Peace, love, and light, Pisces. I hope the sun is shining wherever you are and you're living in your greatest purpose. Pisces, thank you for all your likes, comments, shares, and subscribes. We are on the road to 10K. Thank you for your support and getting there. Personal readings are being offered at this time. All information can be found in the community tab as well as the description box. Let's get into your messages. Uh, Pisces, messages for Pisces. Hmm. High Priestess. And magician showing up right away. One, two. Hmm. This is very like. This is a very powerful like energy that's showing up. High priestess and the magician. So you may be the high priestess or the magician. Okay, let's see. Messages for Pisces. Two of Cups. Perhaps this magician is manifesting a Two of Cups or... Age of Swords, possibly someone watching. Five of Wands, possibly someone who's struggling to come towards you. Lover's card. There's someone that's that may possibly be observing this person may be observing your morale they may be observing your beliefs your practices what you do like they're learning about you someone's learning someone is learning about you and your potential for a two of cups and i'm also seeing that that same person may have also left a two of cups and they're kind of like struggling to start over this person this person seems to have an interest in you lover's card and there's there there may be like a conflict regarding some two of cups situation that they may just have left that's kind of like mm, creating some it may be creating an energy of hesitancy it's either like they may not have like officially left the person i'm seeing that you know they may be separated like the tower card showing up with the two of cups it's it's an energy of separation so this person may have just recently uh divorced or they separated something happened in that previous connection And I'm seeing that, that your spirit guides are trying to tell you there's an energy of hesitancy towards this person. And you may have wanted to know this or you may have needed to know that this person possibly could be hesitant for this specific reason. It could be that they're hesitant to give you. They're hesitant to kind of like put all of them in. This person may actually be studying you. This may this may be a divine feminine studying a masculine. Ace of Wands showing up. Someone may possibly want to start a connection. This person may want to start a connection. They also want to give you more. They're wanting to. 
give you more and I'm seeing that them wanting to give you more or or possibly you may at this time see like a lack of that and it may be due to just them kind of It's them processing a past connection. This person's processing a past connection, trying to heal from it. See? They're trying to heal from a past connection that really left them scarred. Really left them scarred. And this is this is actually the conflict right now for this person. This is why they're so conflicted. Conflicted like if you see that there's an energy of like them being hesitant they're wanting to give you so whoever it is that they sever ties with there's something about this uh, this past connection with this person something that happened Tell me about this Ten of Swords. Mm. This person may not have been like completely honest with them. Maybe a King of Cups, another water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio that wasn't really honest with them. And it wasn't just honesty. It just seems like... Um, this person was selfish. Yeah, this person was selfish. They only looked out for themselves. See, it's like this energy of the Seven of Cups. It almost seems like this person is like window shopping. This person, <laughs> uh, this person, see, whatever relationship this person left, they were. And this could be you too. This this actually could be you. Like the roles may be reversed. Like you may be the one that went through this where, you know, you were dealing with someone that was very selfish. They were window shopping while they were in a relationship. Mm. There it is. <coughs> and it's almost like, uh, like saying that this person was window shopping while they were in a relationship is pretty selfish it basically means that this person was in a relationship while they were looking for another like they were trying to find someone else or next person to kind of like satisfy their needs this person may have had some kind of like ego problem where they wanted people to kind of like they wanted people they wanted to be around people or they wanted people that were going to kind of like uh someone that wanted to stroke their ego or people that that wanted to stroke their ego This person, they kind of like thrived on someone telling them these things.
complimenting them, stroking their ego. <laughs> this person may have actually had a fan base or it's appearing as that. Tell me about this page of wands. So, okay, so you're dealing with someone who is dealing with someone who is also dealing with someone. Mm. And whatever the person that it's like the two people that are showing up, they're needing to do some some healing work. Hmm. Ten of Pentacles. Someone may be experiencing some financial loss. Or they're feeling like they gotta So what I'm seeing here is that Pisces, you may be dealing with, and the roles may be reversed. You may be dealing with a, a feminine who's kind of like watching you. And I'm seeing it could be a, a divine masculine as well. Who's watching and studying you. Who wants to give to you. Ten of Pentacles. Who wants to kind of like build a foundation with you. Yet there's some conflicts having to do with their past. Hmm. Okay. Your spirit guys are telling you to, um, or either you or this person to kind of like wake up because they're they're sleeping on an opportunity it could be this person i'm seeing that there's you know your spirit guides are telling them hey like you're either sleeping on an opportunity or you're missing out on an opportunity mm, there it is more opportunity showing up Now I'm seeing here that you may appear in the Queen of Swords energy as someone who's very clear about what you want. Now this person, this energy of them kind of like seeming hesitant has to do with them trying to heal from something that's kind of like keeping them stuck. And they're needing to have the willpower necessarily to move, that's necessary to move forward. Okay, let's see what's showing up here. Messages for Pisces. This person, whoever's showing up that's like needing to do some spiritual work, it seems like, it almost seems like they're taking too long. <laughs> ah, okay. So, Ingonyama. This is like a masculine energy, so it may be a masculine. White Buffalo Woman. And Circle Cross of Tanan is showing up again. Five. It says here, your plans and purpose are aligned with greater cosmic forces. Whether you see it coming or not, things will fall into place and what you have been working towards will come to fruition. Hmm. 
the divine shall correct a situation that is in need of realignment okay so that may be this person 44 This oracle signifies hope and reunion after a challenging or dark time. There will be harmony in a coming together in sacred purpose after putting pain or conflict behind you. Okay, so this person may need to do exactly that. Put the conflict behind them. Put their past behind them. That's what's bringing the conflicts. So this right here, it says there's an awakening and healing and strengthening of divine masculine energy. Yeah, I'm really getting the sense that it might, it might be a masculine here within the soul for taking the initiative and leading with wisdom. Healing masculinity is relevant at both physical and psychological levels. To love and make peace with the masculine allows it to become dynamic, expressive of integrity. Mm. Well okay so this is kind of like confirmation uh the person that is showing up in your energy okay the person that is showing up in your energy is actually mm, it's actually watching you they're interested in the connection and again this may be vice versa and they're dealing with their own stuff having to do with a past that's like this healing for them though it, it's about their masculine energy like someone's healing their masculine energy and doing this is going to give them the strength that they need and the willpower well the healing uh is going to give them the strength and the willpower to move forward um to really like commit themselves to you It seems like they have the right intentions. And now it's just like... For some of you, it may appear as if it's taking quite a bit because you feel like this person may not be putting their all or they may not be... They may not show up as committed as you'd like them to. And again, this person could be going through like they could be experiencing or going through like a separation procedure or divorce mm, this person may be going through some like i'm definitely seeing separation and i'm seeing it's like ending this for good is what's going to allow them to like completely devote themselves And whatever happened in that situation, I'm not seeing that it's something that this person is going back to. Like, you see this? Ten of Swords. It doesn't seem like this person is going back to that. So your spirit guides are telling you, you're crossing a threshold in this connection with this person. And you may need to be patient. That is the message. If this message resonates, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Until next time, love, peace, divine light.